In this video, we are going to talk about average, which is also known as arithmetic mean in the mathematical world. So you must have heard people talking about average salary of employees in an organization. So how do they calculate the average salary of employees? Let's say that we have three employees and they have salaries as 10,000 rupees, 15,000 rupees and 20,000 rupees. What is the average salary of these three employees? So to calculate the average salary of these three employees, first step is to add these three salaries. So let's do it. Then once we add the salaries, we have the complete stockpile of cash right there. Now we have to distribute this cash to all of these three employees in such a way that each of the employee get the exact amount of cash. To do that, we'll have to divide this complete sum of salaries by the number of employees and in this case the number of employees is 3. So that's how we are going to get the average salary which is equal to 10 plus 15 plus 20 is 45,000 divided by 3 and that is 15,000. So 15,000 rupees is the average salary of these three employees. So let us write the basic definition of average. So average is equal to the sum of all the numbers divided by the count. So whenever there is a problem that has a list of numbers and you have been asked the average of that numbers, then what you do is take the sum of all the numbers and then divide it by the count. That is the total number of numbers. So that's how you calculate average. So what is the average of 2, 3, 5 and 10? Well the count here is four numbers that is we have four numbers here and we know the formula for average which is the sum upon count. So the sum is equal to 2 plus 3 plus 5 plus 10 divided by the count is 4. So 2 plus 3 plus 5 plus 10 is 20 divided by 4 which comes out as 5. So the average of these numbers is 5. So I have a question for you now. Find the average of first five prime numbers. Okay, let us first list the first five prime numbers. So the first prime number is two. Next, we have three. Next, we have five, then seven and 11. So we have the first five prime numbers there. And average is equal to the sum of all of these numbers, so which is 2 plus 3 plus 5 plus 7 plus 11 divided by the count. The count is 5 divided by 5. So this is 2 plus 3 is 5 plus 5 is 10 plus 7 is 17 plus 11 is 28 divided by 5. And 28 divided by 5 is 5.6. Let us do another a bit trickier question here. If the average of these numbers is 7, find the value of x. We know the formula for average which is sum upon count. So what is the sum of these 5 numbers? Well, let us write it 1 plus 5 plus 7 plus x plus 12 divided by the total number of numbers that is the count is 5 there are 1 2 3 4 5 numbers and the average is given which is 7 so 1 plus 5 plus 7 plus x plus 12 divided by 5 is 7 so this is 1 plus 5 is 6 6 plus 7 is 13 plus x plus 12 is equal to this 5 comes to the right of equals to which becomes 7 times 5 which is 35 13 plus 12 is 25 plus this x is equal to 35. Therefore, x is equal to 35 minus 25, which is 10. So the value of x, if the average of these five numbers is 7, is 10.